What if I told you that a new type of electric motor has been developed, one that achieves a record-breaking efficiency of over 99%? Sounds unbelievable, right? For more than a century, engineers have fought for every fraction of a percent in motor efficiency. But now, ABB has built something radically different. It's a brushless synchronous electric motor that throws out the old limitations, eliminating slip rings and brushes, and pushing performance into territory we've never seen before. You'll be surprised to know this machine could save more than 61 gigawatt hours of energy across its lifetime, cutting CO2 emissions equal to removing 10,000 cars from the road every single year. This isn't science fiction, and it's not just a prototype hidden in a lab. It's real, and it's running. And the most surprising part? Almost nobody is talking about it. In this video, we'll dive into the science behind this breakthrough, explore its game-changing benefits, and take a hard look at the challenges it still faces. Stick around, because what you're about to see could mark the next big shift in industrial machines. Before we start, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Electric motors are everywhere. They drive pumps, industrial compressors, large and small fans, conveyor belts, and even the trains and ships we rely on. In fact, nearly half of the world's electricity is consumed by electric motors. So improving their efficiency isn't just nice, it's critical. Now, here's the kicker. Standard industrial motors are already very efficient. They often reach 95 to 96 percent. That may not sound impressive, but in energy engineering, squeezing out another 1 percent can take decades of research and mean billions in savings. And ABB has done something remarkable, creating a motor that hits over 99 percent efficiency. Over a 25-year lifespan, that tiny difference translates to more than 61 gigawatt hours of energy saved. That's equivalent to removing 10,000 cars from the road every single year. So, what makes this machine so special? Let's break it down. Most synchronous motors use brushes or slip rings to transfer electricity to the rotor. These wear out, create friction, and waste energy. ABB's motor removes them entirely. Instead, it uses wireless power transfer to energize the rotor. No physical contact. That means less maintenance, less energy loss, and a more reliable machine. The stator and rotor are packed with advanced copper windings. ABB applies a process called vacuum pressure impregnation, or VPI. Think of it like pressure sealing every gap and surface with insulating resin. This reduces electrical resistance, protects against humidity and dust, and dramatically extends the motor's life. Efficiency means heat control is critical. ABB designed optimized cooling pathways to keep this giant, and we are talking about a 56 megawatt machine running steadily under brutal industrial conditions. Okay, let's step back. What does 61 gigawatt hours saved actually mean? It's enough to power 6,000 European homes for a year. And financially, it could mean up to $6 million saved in energy costs across its lifespan. These are the industries where this motor will shine, places that run massive equipment 24-7. Every drop of efficiency translates into huge financial and environmental benefits. And here's an incredible detail. This motor, destined for a steel plant in India, has already achieved an efficiency rating of 99.14% during testing. That's a substantial leap from ABB's own previous world record of 99.05% set back in 2017. Efficiency ratings measure the ratio between the energy a motor draws and the amount it turns into motion. The theoretical limit is, of course, 100%, but every decimal closer to that limit is exponentially harder to achieve. That's why the previous record stood untouched for eight years until 2025. Note that this powerful motor in India will operate an air separation unit. This unit has a vital role. It will liquefy the air around us. Once liquefied, the oxygen and nitrogen will separate. This separation is crucial, as it supplies the pure gases needed for steelmaking. 
Such investing in energy efficiency promises a remarkable return in Indian plant, with a payback period expected to be slightly more than three months. Now, before we all celebrate endlessly, let's talk about limitations. Because no technology is flawless, this motor is enormous, designed for heavy industry, not your car or home appliances. That also means it's expensive. We're not talking about something every factory can just swap out overnight. Replacing older motors with this technology may require redesigning power supply systems, cooling setups, or VIN physical foundations. Integration costs can be significant. Finally, when you're already above 95% efficiency, each additional fraction of a percent is harder and more expensive to achieve. Some critics argue the payback period may stretch too long in smaller installations. Despite the challenges, ABB's motor points to an exciting future. As industries chase carbon neutrality, technologies like this are essential. We may see trickle-down effects, smaller, brushless, synchronous designs emerging for mid-scale operations, maybe even renewable energy systems. Think wind turbines or hydro plants operating with record efficiency. It's a reminder that innovation isn't always flashy. Sometimes it's about making something that already works, work just a little bit better. And when you multiply that across the entire world, the results are staggering. So here we are, looking at a motor that many people haven't even heard about, yet it could quietly change the landscape of heavy industry. Over 99% efficiency, decades of energy savings, and a design that challenges what we thought was possible. The question is, will it remain a niche solution for the biggest players, or could it inspire a new generation of machines across industries? If you're thrilled about innovative technology that disrupts century-old conventions, we're only scratching the surface. Subscribe for more captivating stories, discoveries that won't make the evening news, yet could fuel the machines of tomorrow. I want to hear from you in the comments. Can this new ABB motor genuinely take the place of other lower efficiency motors? Or is this merely a research dream? I'm eager to know your thoughts. I appreciate your viewership and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thanks for watching and stay curious. I'd love to hear your take. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.